Which moving picture story should we see? It's a movie, Tut. It's called a movie. I've already seen Attack of the Mummy Man. Twenty-seven times. It always seems to end the same. Really? Hmm, there's a surprise. Ah, this one looks good. The day the Earth blew up. Tut, they won't sell us tickets to that. We're too young. They have rules. I am the Pharaoh. I make the rules. I can do whatever I want. Oh, right. Like smuggling a cat into the movie? You okay in there, Luxor? <gasps> oh. Aside from the stench of decomposing armpits, super. <laughs> Come! The day the Earth blew up is starting soon. Hold up, Tut. You need to pick another flick. <laughs> Nonsense. If the Pharaoh wants to see a movie, he sees it. Rules or no rules. You can't do this. I am the Pharaoh. Oh. There are some things even you can't do. How can I not be old enough? I am 3,010 years old! Uh, but, sire, you were mummified as a 10-year-old. So, technically, you're still a kid. Oh, curse my destiny! I'm going to be 10 years old forever! Okay, look, I told my mom I'd be home by 8, so uh, let's pick another movie already. Ah, who needs these idiotic moving picture stories anyway? I want to do something fun! What is that? It's a club, Ted. You dance there. Correction! Oh, you don't. Teenagers do. Amazing! Boys and girls dancing together. That is a new one. Excellent! Let us chuck it out! You mean check it out. Uh, wait! Ted! You can't go in there! We're not old enough! Why do I even bother? Sorry, kid. No one under 17 is allowed in here. I am 3,010 years old. I will have you know. Is that a fact? Well, show me some ID short stuff. Come on. I said ID, not a rock. That is my cartouche, you imbecile. Anyone with a grain of sand for a brain can see that. It says, King Tutankhamun, ruler. Okay, King. You got two seconds to get your cartouche out of here. One, two. Two! Ouch! Come back when you're 17, small fry. Uh, are you all right, small fry? Uh, I mean, oh, mighty pharaoh who has been deeply wronged? Luxor, add that. Muscle-bound ox to my list of subhumans to smite. Yes, sire. Good thing your butt is already bandaged. <laughs> Pharaoh is not amused. Tenstein, I told you we're not old enough to get into that dance club. That is unacceptable. I refuse to be treated like a child. 
Look on the bright side. Most 3,000 10 year olds are just a pile of bones and dust. At least you're a walking pile of bones and dust. But I will never get a chance to grow up. I'm stuck being 10 years old. I will never get to wear a royal beard like grown up pharaohs or, or drive my father's chariot. And what about my side lock? Your side lock? Of hair! See? I'm supposed to cut it off when I'm 13. That's hair? It looks more like some nasty beef jerky. You should cut it off. Thanks to my stupid immortality, I'll never be old enough to cut it off. Some people will give anything to be a kid forever. You never get parking tickets, pay rent, or do income taxes. But I still cannot see the movie I want to see or dance where I want to. I have had it. I refuse to be treated like a fry that is small. Stupid onk! Mocking symbol of long life! I do not want to be ten years old for the rest of time! Mock me no more! That may have been just a tiny bit impulsive. Oh well. Slumber time. Tad, wake up! I've got something to cheer you up. Monster movie DVDs. Cleo, is that you? What's that with your voice? I have no idea what you're talking about. Sire, you look different. Yeah, what happened to you? I grew a beard? Sire, you grew a big honking zit! Not only that, Ted, you've grown taller and older! Really? Excellent! I am no longer a child! <gasps> you've turned into a teenager! But how? I wanted to be older, and now I am! The Pharaoh always gets what he wants! Now, where did I put that thing? Ah, my royal beard. I've waited 3,000 years to wear this thing. Now what? Now I'm going to do everything I've always wanted to do, starting with this. That is so... Nasty. Now no one can tell me I'm too young. The Pharaoh has come of age. Great movie. I never knew that so many things could explode in so many ways. Indeed, sire, but the subplot with the spy shark was a bit hokey. At least no one can stop me from seeing movies with exploding spy sharks. So, Cleo, did you and your friends enjoy your little movie, Robo Kids? Yeah, it, it was great. Natasha, Kyle, this is the um, exchange student I told you about. Uh, uh, Amun. Yeah, Amun. <gasps> Hi, uh, Amun. You definitely have your own thing going. Yes, I have really got it going in. On. You've got it going on. Uh, he hasn't figured out the slang yet. Ew, he should figure out the shower. So, Amun, you like pizza? We're going over to Tony's for a slice. Want to come with? Sorry, but I cannot. I will be attending the dance factory. Wait, uh, Amun! You can't go there! Weren't you going to hang out with me at the museum? Nah, not today. Farewell. Uh, but, uh, Amun! Clee, if you're going to the museum, we're heading over to Tony's. Later! I can't believe this. One zit and Tut thinks he's all that. Well, the Pharaoh is not a little kid anymore. But he's still a major pain, and he's getting worse. Lux, maybe you could sneak in there and keep an eye on him. Uh, do you think he'll run into trouble? <laughs> oh, yeah. Where there's Tidenstein, there's trouble. <laughs>